Esports without drama is like food without salt and the Indian PUBG mobile community is eager to lap up any bit of drama at their disposal. While dramas, fights and narratives are great for building a storyline, they do tend to take their toll on players and organizations as we have seen in the past year. But where there are people, there is drama. And with that being said, we take a look at the top 5 shocking moments in the Indian PUBG mobile scene in 2019. Naman Mortal Mathur is the key face behind PUBG Mobile's immense success in India and the content creator turned streamer turned pro player is loved by many a fan in India. His meteoric rise to success and fame has been truly incredible to watch and in the process he's built up a community of ardent fans and loyal supporters. Post the PMCO Spring Championship, Mortal decided to call it quits on the competitive career to focus more on streaming. His journey was very similar to what a lot of pro players face and like many before him, he was forced to choose between being a professional player and a streamer. His decision would prove to be a major turning point for both him and Sol, as we will discover later, but his decision to focus only on streaming at the peak of his career was something that no one was prepared for. Eventually, Mortal would return to Seoul and lead his team to once again qualify for the PMCO Fall Championship, restoring balance to a world which was not prepared to let their beloved hero not represent them internationally. Having won PMIS in early 2019, Team Seoul had become the darlings of the Indian PUBG mobile community. They further bolstered their position at the PMCO Spring South Asia qualifiers, pulling off a last match miracle and went on to represent India at the main event. Humble, lovable personalities and a sense of friendship as well as brotherhood made the squad extremely likeable and fan favourites. Despite not having the best performance in the Spring Championship, fans were still optimistic about the team and squad. However, Mortal's decision to quit competitive play saw Scout OP replacing him in Seoul. But it was a short-lived affair, as internal conflicts soon engulfed the team. What happened next was probably something that no one was prepared for, as Scout, Oise and Ronak left to form x Park, now known as Fnatic. The community backlash was strong, and to this day, Mortal claims that things will never be okay between him and his former teammates. I want to force you to force me, and what happened, you all know what happened. What happened in front of you, सबके सामने हुआ है उसके बाद मैं ये नहीं चाहता हूँ मैं बिल्कुल नहीं चाहता हूँ मुझे हर्ट हुआ था इसीलिए मैं नहीं चाहता ठीक है आपको लग रहा है सब ठीक हो जाएगा सब ठीक जगह बट नहीं होगा ठीक ऐसे While it may seem like Oise and Ronak were only acting in their best interest, many Seoul fans took it as an act of ultimate betrayal, as did Viper and Mortal, both of whom were hurt by the situation. PMIT was largely expected to be the most premier event in India for PUBG Mobile and while the huge prize pool was a major attraction, a massive controversy erupted in the Group C finals, which were being held in Pune. An unstable internet connection led to massive delays and disconnections during games as frustrated players staged a walkout. The players refused to come back on stage and play out the rest of the matches and it took a great deal of convincing from community members such as 8-Bit Thug to finally get the players to break the deadlock and start playing again. In the end, the matches resumed but a different format was used with every game being played on Sandhawk instead of the other maps as planned earlier. Nonetheless, the competitive integrity of the LAN was compromised and while a makeshift solution was found, let's hope we never have a repeat of the situation. Indian players have their visas rejected. Three Indian teams qualified for the PMCO Spring Championship, which was supposed to be held in Berlin. While Indian Tigers and Team IND were supposed to play in the prelims, Team Seoul qualified directly for the main event. However, excited fans were shocked to hear that all three teams failed to secure their visas for the LAN. Because the prelims were scheduled to play out a week earlier, both Team IND and IT had to play their games from the Nordwin offices in Delhi and with a massive ping disadvantage. Both teams failed to make it to the main event. Seoul too were in danger but finally secured their visas on their third attempt and just made it to the LAN a day before it started. Seoul, a team that has been fighting since the beginning, even fighting to get here to Berlin. Looks like they want to potentially take the fight early as they move up the hill. We see them. However, 
The constant traveling for the visas prior to the event and the fact that they had much lesser time to get accustomed to the devices at LAN affected their performance at the LAN. Hopefully, the team has learned from the incident and will be able to avoid such situations in the future. A content creator and community member who was held in high regard by the community has been Animesh, Thug Agarwal. A recognized caster, streamer and owner of 8-Bit, Thug comes across as a positive person who has done a lot to uplift the entire mobile gaming community in India. Having worked with PUBG Mobile as a caster and an influencer, it seemed only natural when Thug was invited to the PMIT Grand Finals as a guest. However, his invite was rescinded while he was on his way to the event, with the organizer's reason being that it was because Thug had streamed Call of Duty Mobile on his channel a few times in the weeks leading up to the event. Unfortunately, we don't know what prompted PUBG Mobile India to take such an extreme step. But we do know that the matter has since been put to rest and Thug has worked with the organizers since then. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, hit the like button. Also, click subscribe if you want more such content in the future and be sure to ring the bell icon so you get notifications whenever we upload. And that's it for now. I know you haven't subscribed yet.